वेलकम टू गोवा 365 इंग्लिश न्यूज बुलेटिन आई एम लीना एंड दीज आर द हेडलाइंस गोवा इज ऑल सेट टू सेलिब्रेट कार्निवल इट विल हैव अ कुलिनरी पॉप अप्स एक्टिविटीज फॉर चिल्ड्रन म्यूजिक परफॉर्मेंस एज वेल एज द ट्रेडिशनल रेड एंड ब्लैक डांस बोथ कांग्रेस प्लस बीजेपी सेज दे विल फॉर्म द नेक्स्ट गवर्नमेंट आप सेज विल सपोर्ट एनी कोलिजन एक्सेप्ट द बीजेपी Weather will remain dry for the next 5 days. Temperatures expected to rise by 1 to 2 degrees Celsius after another 3 days. And now for the news in detail. Both the Congress and the BJP have expressed confidence that they will form the government in Goa. BJP is seeking a third consecutive term and the Congress with Eli Goa forward has been desperately trying to put their troubles behind it and hope that people will consolidate behind them like they did in the last assembly elections held in 2017 that time people voted 20 of their candidates to the assembly the BJP was in power for last 10 years now people have decided to give their mandate to the Congress Goa forward alliance this time said the congress and goa forward leadership thanking goans for supporting them with our leaders right from shri rahul gandhi ji to shri mati priyanka gandhi ji many other leaders who came we interacted with them and whatever they they told us we try to follow that and today i think we have been able to present ourselves as people who can bring about change who can improve the politics in the state of goa and also to give a credible government which will come out with good policies good programs for the people for the youth for the women for the st community for all communities for minorities and to take everybody together both in uttarakhand and in goa the congress party is winning that is what feedback we have got from our ground from some private exit polls both these states congress is in front and in both these states <coughs> our government will be formed गोयच्या प्रजेन एक मनातल्या मनात ठाम निर्धार घेतला की या राज्यात परत बीजेपीचे सरकार खंचाय परिस्थितीत येऊपा जायना आणि आज ज्यांना वोटिंग कम्प्लीट जाता त्यांना आमकां जो फीडबॅक मेळटा आणि तातूंत प्रत्यय येता ते पळले जर असे दिसता की गोयकारांनी आपल्या प्रजेचो म्हणजे प्रजेचो आवाज ऐकुपी सरकार परत सत्तेर हाडपचे ठरेना आणि म्हणूनच हा पहिले म्हणजे सगळ्या गोयच्या प्रजेचे कांग्रेस पक्षाच्या वतीन काळजातल्यान देव बरे करू म्हणतात तांकां की तांणी काँग्रेसचे गोवा फॉरवर्डाचे आव्हानाक रिस्पेक्ट दिलो तांकां कन्विन्स जाले ते पटले तांकां की हे सरकार येऊचे जो प्रजेचो आवाज आयकत खऱ्या अर्थान प्रजेचे सरकार त्या प्रजेक जाय आशिल्ले आणि तांकां सगळ्यांक देव बरे करू म्हणटा असना आमचे सगळे कार्यकर्ते हा सदांच म्हणटा की इलेक्शन जिंकले आम्ही जरी इलेक्शन जिंकले जरा इलेक्शन हे आम्ही कार्यकर्त्याच्या फोर्साचेर जिंकतात जो पर्यंत काँग्रेसचो कार्यकर्तो चार्ज जायना तो पर्यंत आम्ही इलेक्शन जिंकपास शकना आणि म्हणून सगळे कार्यकर्त्यांक काळजातल्यान देव बरे करू म्हणटा की तांणी अत्यंत प्रतिकूल परिस्थिती तांची इतली प्रेशरां खंयच्यान हाजे फोन ताजे फोन हे सगळे आसताना सुद्धा तांणी फर्म रावन आमच्या कॅन्डिडेटा बरोबर काम केलें आणि आमकां आज बहुमत दिवपाचो तांणी अत्यंत बरे परिस्थितीत प्रतिकूल परिस्थितीत सुद्धा प्रयत्न केलो जे कोण पण सांगतात बावीस मे बावीस म्हणून ते स्मेल ऑफ एरोगन्स तांचे तकलेक पावर मारिल्ली आसा तांकां तांचे पाय जमनी वेल्यान वयर गेल्या ते पाय आणि ते तांचे एरोगन्स हे दहा तारखेक जेव्हा रिझल्ट डिक्लेअर जातले तेव्हा खाड घेऊन पडटले सकल पाय परते जमनीचेर येतले आणि एरोगन्स ही कमी जातले काँग्रेस अँड गोवा फॉर्वर्ड अलायन्स विल गिव्ह पॉलिटिकल फ्रीडम टू गोवा देर आर इंडिकेशन दॅट पीपल विल एक्सेप्ट दॅम वी विल फुलफिल people's expectations go forward supremo vijay sardes has said vijay is pitted against bjp's tamu naik in a do or die battle in fatodda ani goykarani maka ista vichar kelo ki gut ek alternative mune da ani ji goya kari mukti diu shakta ya sagle corruption achi ani ek koi chi koi chi naav bare sudhru shakta defection nahi nasta ek comprehensive victory दिवपा खातीर तांनी मत मारला असे सगळे संकेत मेळतात त्याच्या खातीर गोयच्या जनतेक देव बरे करू म्हणतात लास्ट नाईट आफ्टर द इलेक्शन्स द बीजेपी टू एक्सप्रेस कॉन्फिडन्स दॅट पीपल हॅव गिव्हन 
its mandate once again and thanked voters. Listen to what BJP state president Sadanand Chetta now said. voting percentage definitely कि भारतीय जनता पार्टी परत एकदा या गोंया भीतर तिसऱ्या वेळेचे राज्य करतली आणि तो कौल जो असा तो दहा मार्चात ऍक्च्युअल ओपन जातकच त्या रिझल्ट जो असा तो त्यांना जातलो पण त्यांनी पहिली एक सगळ्या गोयकारांचे सगळ्या वोटरांचे हा धन्यवाद मानपात सत्ता इर्शा शेख फॉर गोत्र 65 फ्रॉम पणजी Amatmi Party today expressed confidence that it felt that voting trends yesterday would allow it to form a part of government in the next term. However, AAP would only join a non-BJP coalition. A day after elections, Goa convener Rahul Mamre expressed confidence that Goans will give a chance to implement the Kejriwal model of governance in Goa. There was good response to AAP looking at yesterday's voting. But if not, AAP will play the role of opposition, he said, pointing out that there has been no opposition to the government in the past five years. However, Mahamre said that irrespective of the results, AAP will continue to fight for Goans. I am the Delhi Minister of the National Council. I am saying that we are clear that we are the government, we are the government. We are against the BJP coalition. किदे लीडरशिप असते त्या प्रमाणे आम्ही कोलिशन असतले समजा गरज पडले आले आमका फुल मेजॉरिटी मेनाले आणि आमचा आसपास सदा असतले हेल्थ एज्युकेशन जे रिफॉर्म असतो जावते वी जातो तातून आमचा नक्की आसपास असतले आणि ते आम्ही रिफॉर्म करतले आमचा जो एजेंडा असा हेल्थ एज्युकेशन तातून ते एजेंडा मी नेटात पुढे वरतले भाजप सोडून खच्या पक्ष आम्ही सपोर्ट करतो सपोर्ट करतले सगळे गोयकार पळितले की तांचो रिप्रेझेंटेटिव्ह आम आदमीचो रिप्रेझेंटेटिव्ह विधानसभेन गोयात तांचे इशू घेन असतलो गेली 5 वर्ष ऑपोजिशन जो रोल करप ले करतो तो आम आदमी पार्टी आणि आता विधान विधानसभेन सुद्धा आम आदमी पार्टी सरकारान असतले आणि आमचे जे स्कीम्स असतात गावचे एज्युकेशन पावर सेक्टर रिफॉर्म करपाचे असतात आणि झिरो करप्शन ते फक्त आम आदमी पार्टीचे सरकार हटले निकाल किदे असुने आम आदमी पक्ष लोकांचे इशू घेऊन सदा पुढे वतले आम्ही जे हंगा मानचे बसता ते सगळे गोयकारांगे वचन दिता रिझल्ट तुम्ही किदे दिया कसोय कॉल दिया आम्ही तुमच्या बरोबर सदा असतले गर्जेक आम आदमी पार्टी आणि फुडारी सदा फुडे असतले संकटाच्या टायमार कोविडच्या टायमार आम आदमीच असले फुडे गरज पडल्यावर आम आदमीचे प्रत्येक गावात जे व्हॉलेंटियर असा नेता असा विधानसभेत तेच फुडे असतले मतदारांचा उत्स्फूर्त प्रतिसाद काल मिळला असा आम आदमी पार्टी आम्ही वता असताना आमचा लोक वेगवेगळ्या तऱ्हेन आमका विश करताले स्माईल दिताले त्यातल्या त्यांचा मोग आमच्या विरुद्ध आमच्या बरोबर दिसून येता रिझल्ट दातर के किते येता तो यो पण आम आदमी पार्टी आज गोयान स्थिर झाली असा गोयान एक स्थिर सरकार देऊपाची परिस्थिती आम आदमी पार्टी असली हजबद्दल मका डाउट ना ब्युरो रिपोर्ट गोवा 365 वी विल टेक अ शॉर्ट ब्रेक स्टे विथ अस वेलकम बॅक With carnival dates quickly approaching, CCP along with industry stakeholders and citizens announced the series of events planned for this year's festival. The four-day celebrations will include culinary pop-ups, activities for children, music performance as well as the traditional red and black dance which will be held on the last day. Here's more. Garcia de Orta will transform into Samba Square during the four-day celebrations. Hotels and restaurants across the city will feature special carnival theme menus and a host of food stalls and pop-ups will line Samba Square and Miramar Beach front. Samba Square will also feature a pop-up bazaar planned by entrepreneurs. To top this off, planning authorities have also announced that there would be a stray dog adoption zone as well. Festival is going to be one of the unique one because This festival is going to feature a lot of leading musicians, a lot of leading artists on all the days, all four days of the carnival in the evening. We will be having musicians and and uh, possibility, a very good possibility of some uh, good celebrities from Bollywood. The, we are not finalized as the names of who it is. At the moment it is uh, confirmed, we will let you all know. The second day of the carnival, the 27th, we intend to hold a rally, a vintage car rally, for which quite a number of vehicles, vintage vehicles will feature and they will be kept for display at the multiplex uh, courtyard. For this uh, carnival, in uh, Panjim Carnival celebration in Samba Square, 
which is near Gracia, the Ortha Garden. The artery roads will be closed. We already requested the DM, collector North Goa, and the roads are going to be closed to so all vehicle traffic. Stalls will be set up there. Stalls that will feature. We are this carnival will be trying to mainly focus on traditional Goan food. We are giving a lot of emphasis on Goan food and making priority to Goan food, which earlier used to be bypass for Chinese and other kind of uh, foods. We are also having various basking stations. Basking stations are the musicians who will be playing at street corners and various other designated places. Our intention is beyond is to promote the local food vendors. We have been a lo lot of local food vendors who are excellent in their food, in their products. Lesser known people do not know them because the higher brands have uh, these uh, big big brands have taken over. Nobody knows the actual uh, value of these small timers. So these food vendors will be coming, will be featured in a big way, and we try to encourage them, try to give as much as publicity and advertisement. Children's Carnival will be organized in one side of the Samba Square, wherein there will be a series of games, amusement for the children. And I'm sure the children are going to really have a good time because the layout is, is going to be a very uh, exclusive one. Shamchari for Goa 365 from Panaji. A total of 11,64,224 voters cast their votes to decide the fate of 301 candidates. The voting percentage was 78.94%, this time less than last time's figures. However, all indications are that it will be a fractured mandate. The number of male voters is 5,66,241, while the number of female candidates is 5,79,974. The highest number of voters was reported. 35,552 in Vasco constituency, while the lowest number of voters was 20,412 in Murmuga constituency. 12,546 people voted through postal ballot. Chief Electoral Officer Kunal gave this information. We had 11,64,224 electors, out of which for the first time we had 9 transgender electors. These all were added with the efforts of the, our electoral registration officer with the help of NGOs. The biggest assembly constituency in terms of electors is Vasco de Gama, which is 35,552. The smallest is the neighboring Norbungaon, which is 20,412. In 2017 election, we had 11,10,866 electors. The biggest assembly was Vasco de Gama, 35,601. The smallest was the smallest was Sun 20,941. This time we are having 298 service electors for which we have sent postal ballot through electronic means by way of ETPBS system. We able to tag 9,590 PWD electors. We have total 29,797 80 years old and above electors. These two figures are important because for the first time, Election Commission of India has extended the facility of absentee voters. And for these absentee voters, Form 12B was issued to the BLO and 13,150 postal ballots were issued and total postal ballot absentee votes lasted is 12,546 by the all the these categories of absentee voters. This time we had total 301 candidates out of which male candidates were 275, female candidates 26. General candidates were 292, SC candidates were 9. Total polling stations we have is 1722. Police confiscated a total of 12.72 crore worth of wealth at the time of election which included money, alcohol, gold, drugs and other things. An FIR has been registered against the accused for violating the election code of conduct, IGP Rajesh Kumar said. No major incidents were reported. Of course, there were calls of uh, some dispute, minor kind of disputes, 
38 calls were received, but no complaint was serious enough to be converted into a crime. Of course, there were three FIRs registered which are related to uh, model code of conduct that are separate. There was not they were, that was action by the police as per norms as and when they received an information. To ensure the peaceful conduct of elections, I had been uh, briefing you earlier also. We kept our pressure on all the anti-social elements. We took preventive action against more than 1,700 people in the state of Goa. We called history sheeters, bad tractors of the police station. Rather, sometimes our PIs visited them and warned them not to indulge into any anti-social activity. Irsha Sheikh for Goa 365 from Panaji. We will take a short break. Stay with us. Welcome back. India reported 27,409 COVID-19 cases in last 24 hours, 24% lower than yesterday. Daily positivity rate has been deep to 2.23%, comparatively lower than yesterday. 347 deaths were reported in last 24 hours. Goa 2 reported 85 cases and 3 deaths in last 24 hours. There has been a dip in cases for the last few weeks. The positivity rate too is declining along with the cases. The daily positivity rate now stands at 2.33% while weekly positivity rate stands at 3.63%. Meanwhile, Mumbai reported 349 cases and 3 deaths in the last 24 hours. The daily positivity rate stands at 0.88%. For the first time, Mumbai's positivity rate has declined below 1% during the third wave. Goa sees 85 new cases, 3 deaths, 27,409 cases reported all over India, 347 deaths reported in the last 24 hours, daily positivity rate dips to 2.23%, 173.42 crore citizens vaccinated, Mumbai's positivity rate dips below 1%. Goa is witnessing a dip in daily cases for the last two weeks now. Even during low daily cases, one or few deaths are still being reported. Bureau Report, Goa 365. And now for the weather. The weather is very likely to remain dry for the next five days starting from February 15 according to IMD. Temperatures are expected to rise by 1 to 2 degrees Celsius after another three days. Maximum and minimum temperatures are likely to hover around 31 degrees Celsius and 20 degrees Celsius respectively. Minimum temperature is not expected to rise for the next three days after which it will rise by 1 to 2 degrees Celsius. Haze and light fog is expected at isolated areas early tomorrow morning. As such, those travelling are advised to remain cautious. Skies are expected to turn cloudy toward the evening over the state. While Goa will continue to enjoy dry weather, IMD has issued a rainfall and thunderstorm warning for several states across India, including Andaman and Nicobar Islands, Tamil Nadu, South Kerala and Kashmir. There are no weather or fisherman warnings issued so far for Goa. Dry weather for the next five days. Maximum and minimum temperatures today 31 degrees Celsius and 20 degrees Celsius respectively. 1 to 2 degrees Celsius rise in minimum temperatures expected after three days. Rainfall warning issued for several states across India. Goa not included in the list. Bureau report Goa 365 with inputs from IMD. And with that we have come to the end of this news bulletin. For more news and updates from our website www.goa365.tv. Follow us on Facebook Goa 365 TV and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel Goa 365 TV or download our app which is available on both Android and iPhones to watch all the latest news and updates on your mobile. Take care, stay safe and keep watching Goa 365.